Hello and welcome. This is Mouse Cutter, and we're back with some more pit people. And I think it's time to get back onto the side quest. And to do that, I'd like to switch over to my A team. But first, we're going to have to switch out Sophia here. At least I, I think we're going to have to do that. Um, you know, we never did get a chance to try out the the bat guy here. Um, but sure, we'll put in that place, and then let's switch over back to A, and we can put in, let's see, Sophia. And then we have one slot open. So I could use the spider lady, and then I could have somebody ride her back, uh, somebody with ranged attacks. Right now, Yosef is set up for ranged attacks. Uh, although the weapon he used didn't seem like it was all that effective, at least to what I'm used to. We could give him a different ranged attack. Yes. For instance, we could do one of these. Hmm, this gives him stun effect? Oh, that's interesting. So this attack here has a stun effect attached to it. It doesn't do as much damage. Uh, I, I think that's probably a special effect of specifically that type of attack, though. And then this one is just a, you know, much more damage. I kind of like the stun effect, so let us do that. And that's what uh, this character used to do anyway. And then we could have him ride the spider lady. Alternatively, we could have another character in here. Now, we didn't get... A to a chance to try out the vampire, so we don't really know how good that character is. We've already experimented with the kobolds, and as much as I like the kobolds, and they could be a good addition to the team, I'm a little bit concerned that they don't do enough damage. The question I have, is this guy have comparable move speed? Because if so, mm, I don't think so. Let's, uh, let's just do a direct comparison. I wish you could more easily do a direct comparison. Yeah, see, these guys have four movement, which is, you know, pretty high, and uh, obviously better than the three that this guy has. All right, well, I think I'm going to go ahead and go with the, uh, the spider lady here, and we're going to have a combination of Yosef riding... Uh, the spider lady, and that way he can put out his ranged attacks and also be safe. And then we'll do uh, the rest of the normal party. So there we go. I think that's going to be what we go for. Let us go pick our mission. All right, so the first thing we're going to want is we're going to want at least one recruit cage. Because it's uh, we're doing quests, I figure we might as well uh, only have one cage. And then we've got a couple quests here we can choose. And it looks like also if I hit the space, maybe I switch up what quests we have. But I think I want to stay with the chain we currently have. So we could finish off maybe uh, the Tinkle Town quest, although the difficulty ramps up with that. You know what? Why not? Let's go ahead, finish the Tinkle Town uh, quest. I don't know how many parts this uh, series is, but we'll see. All right, looks like we have to go down, which this is a little bit unexplored territory here. But we get some gold. All right, looks like we're going to have to go around that way. Hmm. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to avoid this fight. Let's see if I can. There we go. Okay, here we go. Here's a look, leader. Oh, don't you tell me what to do? Hell, I am. Then you go to visit how to get it. I didn't know. How you say, I know, say, so they got that, eh? And then, to be that way, I'll be moving down there to do it, I'll be like it. 
Up here, and then to me that way, Tayberry and Oliver. I got it back in. You got it, Tayberry. And you are? You got it. Huh. Pisha, what's at the pool? P, what do I say? I'm a pila. Who's the name? What's that? Oh, who's this? Is that? Scoot it. Scoot it. Hey, you got it. Do it. Hey, come on. Come on. Two, three. Hey, ding, ding. Pripa, pipa. Bibili, bibili. Pupa, pripa. Pai, let it pay. Yes, careful, black big truck. Put it over, lay it on the wall. I go, here's the door, eh? Well, he doesn't have any population to vote him in anymore, does he? Because <laughs> we just killed them all. Okay. <laughs> I guess we're gonna... Alright. Oh. Okay, well, I was talking about the zombies in uh, a previous uh, video, so it looks like we might have a chance of capturing one. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Do we have to kill the poop again? No? Alright. Um, I should probably uh, stand on the poop and try and uh, net this troll so he doesn't wreak havoc on me. No. Was it just one troll? Yeah, just one. Okay. Um, so we have to decide which of these zombies is the coolest looking. Oh, we gotta go with that one. With the hockey mask. Um, ooh. I want to jump on the spider lady's back, but it... Uh, Unfortunately, those two characters are too far away from each other. Um, all right, well, I'll move, uh, move Estrella up here. Come on, Spidey Lady, there you are. Um, I'll move her here, I guess. We can't quite get there. I don't think you can have her move and jump on her back the same turn, though, so... Uh, then we'll just move over and smack this guy. Who must be counted as wearing a helmet because uh, we have a not as good ability to hit him. <laughs> okay, so the poop on the ground is, is, is throwing out toxic. Okay. Um, interesting. It's actually kind of hard to stay away from it because all the bad guys are right next to it, right? Um, well, I could go here and net this guy. And I don't really have much of a choice here, so I'm just going to have to stay where, where I am. Um, okay, well, I'll move up this far, I guess. I guess I could move there, maybe get away from it. Although, I'm moving on top of the poop, aren't I? Well, it is what it is. Let's jump on her back. And... It might be okay... Here. Oh, nope, not the spider lady. I can't move with her. I thought I was on gluten. There we go. Okay. Okay, now we can move around. We're going to have to kill the troll anyway, so 
Might as well get in there. Now I'm a little bit confused. Does it only hit me if I'm standing on top of it? Because it hit me before and I wasn't. Hmm. Not really sure. Well, I'm going to have to stand next to it because it just it's so all over the place. Okay. I'll move up this way. And then you can just stay where you are and keep uh, these guys back. All right. Except I'm beating on the guy I want to uh, capture. I guess it doesn't really matter as long as I get a zombie. All right, we'll find out if these two... Oh, no, they didn't get hit. So you have to be on top of it, apparently. Okay, I want to finish this guy off if I can. And to do that, we'll put those two over. And then you... Hmm. I don't know if I have a great place to put gluten. I'll try and go around back, because that's kind of where we're going. And... Spider Lady, you can move there, I guess. And you can stay there, and we're good to go. Ah, uh, we attacked the wrong person there. Otherwise, we would have had that one zombie down. Alright, well, we'll uh, be able to kill that zombie a little bit better, I guess. Um, hmm. I'll move here, but I'm a little bit... Uh, Concerned about that move. You can stay where you are. You can stay where you are. And this character, it's pretty much uh, impossible to move anywhere without getting uh, in the poop. So uh, I'm just going to stay where I am, I guess. All right. Okay, we got lucky there and hit the target we wanted to hit. All right, you're going to have to just run away because otherwise you're going to get uh, beat on. Um, move there. Stay there. Hmm. It's going to be hard not to move in a way that gets me on poop. Um, guess I'll just step up uh, here. Okay. Uh, that's unfortunate. We're hitting the wrong guys. I want to capture a zombie. Okay. I'll move there. Stay there with Spider Lady. Move there. Guess you can move around to there. And... Hmm... I guess we'll take the one with... Alright, I'll move there and we'll try and net somebody. If I net the, the troll, all the better, but... Now we keep hitting the wrong characters with the range attacks, unfortunately. As a matter of fact, that might be the only valid target, now, now that I think about it. Okay. Well, at this point, I think I'm just going to move there. And it's quite possible we won't be able to recruit somebody. I'll be bummed out if that happens, but... There's only so much I can do about it. And we'll just stay where you are. Because the hair troll's in the middle of the group, and I have to kill it. And there's only, you know, so many places I can move. All right, so now we have to move in a way that we're not attacking this guy anymore, if we want to capture him.
Okay. So we'll want to move there. Um, you know what? You just move away. Uh, we'll still be able to get the range attack off, so that will be fine. And then... You can move there, and you can go into netting position in case we get the net off. And everybody else can just stay where they are. Okay, we got it. And... Oh! <laughs> I never killed that zombie down there. Okay, I was kind of wondering, why didn't I recruit? And it's because this guy's over here. Okay. No wonder. Alright, well, um... I guess I'll move there, and you can help me kill that one. Hopefully we get the attacks off before the net lands. There we go. That works. Okay, we got a zombie. A corpses that refuse to die. Overwhelming in numbers, resistant to poisonous gases, standing on their graves, keep them at bay. Oh, do they resurrect? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, I see the grave and I see that it's glowing like red. Maybe after a, a couple turns, they resurrect themselves. Okay. All right, well, I don't know if that completes the quest entirely. We'll find out. I'm also curious because it said there are overwhelming numbers if that's another character that you get two of. Kind of like the kobolds. Okay. Let's go back home. I'm going to try and go a little bit different way. And get some gold along the way. Why not? All right. Should be close to home. There it is. All right. We'll just go in and we'll see what the zombie's all about. We did end up getting the zombie I wanted. Now, I'm just curious is that the end of that quest? No, okay, there's another level of it. All right. But for now, I'm just going to go check out the party and see what we got here. So, does look like only one character. So we put that in here. Oh, no, no, it is two. And I'm assuming that's the resurrect ability. And then they're also slow. Okay. Now, they do more damage than the kobolds do, I think, and they're also immune to poison. So, just as a comparison here, we go to the kobolds. Kobolds do less damage, but obviously they have a lot more movement ability than these zombies do. And I think movement ability is... Uh, Super important. Now, the slow, I think, is them giving slow to somebody else. But they're also slow, as in their movement speed is not very high. Hmm. It'd be interesting to play them uh, a little bit. Uh, I think we're going to stay, though, with our, our prime party of Mistletoe, the, the spider lady, and uh, Yosef riding her back. Because that seems like it's a good combo. In any case, I think this is a good point to go ahead and put a cut in the video. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. This is Mouse Gunner. Signing out.